Hi, in this short video I'll show you how you can download Azure Resource Manager templates from Azure for example that could be the Windows Server or Azure SharePoint Farm uh, template. So the first thing we do is that we launch a PowerShell command. Let's call We oh sorry, we import a module. Come on, it's a bit slow. Um, make sure we have import the Azure module. Not imported, import module, Azure. When it's imported, we make sure we we have added an Azure account, add Azure account. You type in your credential for the Azure account. It's always a bit slow to load, so just wait for it. Come on. Clear the screen. So what we got going to do now is to get Azure Resource. Let's see Azure Resource. Can remember? I can't remember the commands. So let's get Azure Resource Manager Group Templates. Oh, we have to ch change switch mode name to the resource manager that's why and there we go we now got the command azure resource resource group gallery template publisher and let's just say microsoft and here you go you get the entire list let's pipe it out to uh Grid view, and here you see all the possible templates available within the store. So let's just filter down to say, for example, SharePoint. Here you see different templates available for SharePoint, and if we go into the Azure portal, that would be the parts available. For example, say in the store or the marketplace. And let's just say SharePoint. Here we see a trial, trial and form. Here we go. Both of them are available in the store. This is actually just a copy of the the template for building the SharePoint farm that we able to extract using one of these templates. Just for the sake of this, I'll show you just the normal export of a Windows template. So let's just do that. Let's get this one. And here you see the definition of Windows. I could also have showed you the definition for SharePoint. Let me just show you that SharePoint. Say, for example, this one. Let me just take this one. And let's put it into the notepad. Boom, quickly. And here you'll actually see if we were to do This we would get the definition, the description of of uh, form itself, and where we could actually download the entire entire um, JSON file from the, from the description. So let's just put that into the browser. You see the part, and the rest is down here. Here we go. So we could get 
the entire resource template down here and just save it or we could use the command line for saving the template just say identity as before and then the path to extracting it and boom we now download the template for windows server and it's available under temp or it should be available yes it is and we should be able to download open up in visual studio as well or any other reader and here we have a description of a windows server deployment when my server finally loads and here you go thanks for watching and yeah this just to clear up things in here this description over here and you have the resources down here you can use the new resource template the new resource template deployment in the portal if you want to it's called let me see if I can find it let's say let's go into marketplace click marketplace here you go just search for templates and deployment templates here you go you could either deploy the environment directly from Visual Studio or you could use this template just to create the environment within the portal so basically yeah just click create edit a template take the information from within Visual Studio drop it into uh, the portal click save and here you'll actually see the information from before the parameters is actually reflected within the portal so so all the information that you saw within the templates is all here actually so just show that so here you go thank you for watching